Hello kids, so today we'll start with a chapter 9 that is the sun, moon and the stars. So you must have seen the sun, the moon and the stars in the sky and the, uh, the slight little blinking stars and you must have seen that in the night, right? So therefore now we'll learn about the sun, moon and stars and what are they and how are they and what is their work, okay? So the sun is a big fall of fire, okay? So it is hot, so it is hot. It is round in shape the sun is much bigger than the earth the sun is much bigger than the earth therefore it gives us light it is very far from us therefore it looks small from the earth so whenever you see a sun but it's not visible as the rays are so much harsh but still it looks small in the form of earth but as it is very 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 far away from us therefore it looks small it gives us heat and light so therefore in summers when you go out you feel so uh, like sweaty and also you feel hot right so therefore it's only because of sun we cannot also live without sun okay so if there's no sun there will be darkness everywhere yes right we cannot put on lights every time right so therefore we have we need to have sun also for having a daylight for having a fresh and a refreshing light because we just cannot be in the darkness every time and we just cannot be with the lights every time right next the sun rises in the east in the morning so morning it is it comes in the east and it sets in the west so whenever you see the uh, the morning sun it comes in the east direction and whenever it settles down it settles down in the evening in the west direction next stars stars are very 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 far away from us like it, they are very far away from the sun also so therefore they appear so small they appear very 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 small so you must have seen like sun moon stars in the sky right so therefore i have put a, put on some pictures for you to uh, check it does they look like this only somehow right okay now stars can be big or small in size so star doesn't have their own shape they can be big they can be small but we see it in our by our naked eyes we see they only as a small part stars are as bright as even brighter than our sun so therefore they are so bright that darkness also their light appears stars are so bright and so even brighter than our sun therefore in the darkness also they twinkle and therefore we see their light the sun is also called as a star so therefore it also blinkles right it also gives us light so therefore it is also called as a star the stars have their own light so therefore they blink in the night so therefore they have their own light the moon is smaller than the earth the moon is smaller than the earth therefore it appears small when we see uh, see the moon in the night the moon gets its light from the sun so therefore it when it, the, when we have a full moon we see it lighted so it gets its light from the sun okay now it has no air no water on it therefore there is no life on moon the moon is not hot like the sun so the the conditions the climatic conditions are not like the sun uh, of the moon clouds are also seen in the sky they are different they are of different colors and also of different shapes you must have seen many clouds in the sky right so therefore they do not have a same shape do you do you see the square shape and the circle shape clouds no they have different shapes we see dark clouds when it is about to rain so it becomes red or black when it is climatic condition of rain we see no clouds on a clear day when there is a clear day when there is a proper light we do not see any clouds there is a rainbow right so rainbow is seen in the sky after heavy rain sometimes so when the rain goes off the rainbow comes you can you must have seen rainbows many times when with the slight light or the sun's light we can see rainbow with the seven colors that is violet indigo blue green yellow orange and red and all of them combine together to form the white light so when all the colors come together it forms a white light so therefore these things the sun the moon the sky the clouds stars 
everything is important for us okay so therefore with this points i finished this chapter over here let's move on to the other by the next video